Welcome back, everyone. It's time for Legal Matters. As kids and teens head back to school, now is the time to think about even more distracted driving. Attorney Paul Hernandez with Calpus <coughs> and Nackman is here with some important information for all drivers. Paul, welcome back to the Hampton Road Thank Show. Thank you for inviting me back. Let's start this segment with just defining distracted driving. Well, distracted driving is any activity that will take the primary attention of driving away from the driver. Mm -hmm. it's, it's many people think it's the two top two things which are texting and cell phone. However, the number one reason or the number one distraction in driving is actually talking to a passenger. Really? And we do that all day long. Uh, additionally, when you have children in the car, that's a, a number one distraction. Mm -hmm. There are several other distractions as well, um, and you probably see these on your way to the on your way to work every morning. <laughs> uh, eating, we all eat in the car. Yeah. We're drinking our Starboard's coffee in mm -hmm. the car. Um, grooming. I know you've seen people shaving uh, or putting on eye makeup. <laughs> that does. That's it's, an it's quite alarming. <laughs> that's an extreme distraction. Mm -hmm. um, using the GPS. How many times have you driven down the interstate and you've seen somebody with a GPS smack dab in the middle of their windshield? Mm -hmm. Not only is it a distraction, you, it, it, one, it's illegal yeah. to have it right in your vision, mm -hmm. but you can't see uh, out the front windshield. Um, watching a video. You know, the new cars nowadays with these uh, uh, GPS that pop out of the uh, front of the dash, yeah. they actually play, play video. That's illegal in Virginia. Mm -hmm. That's also an extreme distraction. Well, let's talk a little bit about texting. As you can yeah. probably see, my wait to text yes. wavy band mm -hmm. on, my, on my thumb. I'm not sure if you knew this, but in 2010, over 3,000 people have died from somebody texting or using a cell phone mm -hmm. and driving. Uh, over 416,000 people in 2010 have been injured as a result of distracted driving based on uh, texting or cell phone activity. Yeah, just to let you know how important it is to just wait. It's not that important that you're going to miss that text message or phone call. You're right. And interestingly enough, and this is a surprising t statistic, you are 23 times more likely to be in a crash by texting and driving than not texting or for any yeah. other distraction alone, 23 yeah. times. And especially, you know, this time, kids heading back to school, they're going to be more kids <clears throat> out on the sidewalks, kids at the bus stops. How important is it for drivers just to be extra, extra careful? For it's, that? it's incredibly important to mm -hmm. do that, you know, uh, and not only is it for the adults, but also the kids. As yeah. we know, kids are not really experienced drivers to begin with. Mm -hmm. You put a, a, a cell phone in front of them, it, it makes it even worse. One more statistic, yeah. if I have a, a couple more yeah, minutes. Go ahead. Just wanted to tell you, when you, when you send or receive a, a text, the average time to send or receive a text is 4.6 seconds. When you're driving, at 55 miles an hour, it is the same as driving blindly for a football field. Oh my gosh. It's an incredible wow. statistic. That and if you stop and think about it, 4.6 seconds. That's, you don't think it's a long time. Yeah, but no. at 55 miles an hour, it's over 100 yards. Wow. See, I think when you put things like that into perspective that people hear, then it may hopefully will make them think twice before getting that text message or that, that tone. Well, some great statistics. Of course, we're going to have that on our website. And of course, for more information on distracted driving and how to get any legal questions answered, you can always get in touch with our friends at Calpus and Nackman online at legalmatters.calpusnackman.com or give them a call. That number is 800-361-0430. Paul, thanks so much. Thanks. Appreciate it.